All right, welcome back to the channel. And today we will be taking a look at some Karens and some interesting moments and some wholesome moments as well. But before we get started, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. So in this first video, this takes place in Palm Beach. Now, in the beginning, one of the employees is explaining the situation, but it's hard to hear. But from what I understand is that she has had too much to drink. It seems like she is by herself. And even though she has a wristband, the employees wanted to verify that she is a guest at this hotel. And she ends up getting very disrespectful with the employees and falling over so they decided to call the officers but check it out for yourself and let me know what you think Too much of a good time? Um, I have a question for you. So are you Julia? What the f are you guys like doing right here? Because I'm gonna get the f off and leave. Uh, if I see any more people surrounding this place. And also, like, why are you surrounding me? Like, I've done nothing wrong. And like, you're watching like people. Like, so. Signal too. She wanna go back in? Yeah. Yeah, she's Oh shit. She doesn't have a room here or she does? Oh. George. Hold on, we'll wait for, we'll wait for the guest. What are you doing? I need to talk to my boyfriend. He's, he's on the way down. Okay. He's coming downstairs. Do you he's know? You. How do you know this? Listen, miss, he's going to meet you outside. How do you know outside. this? I just talked to him. Why are Sorry. we talking to Jerry, me? Jerry's coming right now. Yes, why are we talking to me? Because you're causing a disturbance, that's why. Okay, why are we talking to me? Why are we talking to me? What have I done? They don't want you on the property. That's okay. The so why the the reason is they don't want me on the property. Jerry, where's Jerry at? So please, this is my boyfriend, Jerry. Right? Jerry. Jerry. You, you need to get she, her. She has to leave. Right, take her out of here. Yeah, yeah off the property completely. Off property. Let me get my car. Okay. Why the? Hey, Jules, Jules, Jules. Jules. Let her say anything, please, please. Otherwise, you're gonna get arrested. Uh -huh. Right to remove anybody from the No, but I'm curious. You don't have to do anything. No, but I'm here. I'm just curious. We 
don't yes. we don't know why. They called us because of whatever disturbance you're causing and they want you off the property. That's all we know. You know, I never understood how when the property owners don't want you there anymore and the officers tell you they don't want you there anymore, that somehow people think that they can just talk their way into not being kicked out the establishment. Because at this point, you're only making it worse for yourself and possibly are going to end up racking up more charges. And the boyfriend seems to be sober, so I wonder why he left her out there alone. Although she might have just had wandered off by herself, but who knows. But let's continue to watch. Well, that's it. Oh, so your, your boyfriend's gonna go get your bag and his bag and then you guys are gonna leave. I just am like so Trespassing. Is that what you want to do? Jesus. Across the street. Jesus. Did you see that? 
Multiple people. Exactly. Everywhere. So the boyfriend mentioned to one of the cops that she has mental health problems or whatever, but we don't know if that's true. It could be, but the employee in the beginning did mention that she kept, you know, stumbling over, like if she was drinking, I guess. So we don't know what's the truth, but if she does have mental health problems, hopefully she gets the help she could get. If not, then I think this guy should cut ties with his girlfriend and just run because I don't know why someone would want to be in a toxic relationship like this, but let's continue. So in this next video, we have this lady that went to her job and her job decided to terminate her employment status and losing a job sucks, but it doesn't help that she threw a tantrum and decided to push a chair, which ended up hitting someone else in the process. So of course they decided to call the police officers and things get crazy pretty quickly with one of the cops having to chase her down and immediately catching a resistant arrest charge. But take a look for yourself and let me know what you think. Thank you, I appreciate that. You guys call us? Somebody needs that terminated? Hey, Paul. Where's she at? Please should be walking. She's walking right 
you guys want anything done with her or no? Huh? You want anything done with her or no? I'd want to never be allowed in this building. Okay. Leg shackles in your spot? Yeah. You didn't touch hey, me. Hey, hey. You're going either way, okay? I'm, I Hear didn't do anything. Right, so this could be a misdemeanor right now, right? It's not because I'll, I didn't do anything. Okay, fine. Then if you didn't say anything, we review the cameras and you get out of here, okay? But you gotta part, you gotta, you, you gotta work. Exactly, right. Exactly, right. Because I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. 
found it pretty funny that she kept saying that she was not resisting while resisting when the officer was trying to put her leg inside the car. Now, all she had to do was just go home once she lost her job and could have just applied for a new one. And yeah, losing a job sucks, but now I think it's going to be a lot harder with her having a record. I mean, maybe she already had a record, but this adding on to it is going to make employment a lot more difficult for her. But let's continue. You are not even... So, you made a scene and I so. refused to leave. Ma'am, are you yeah. good? Do you need uh, an ambulance or anything? Okay. So, she was running around here trying to get her stuff and we're following around. She's screaming out front in front of everybody else. We're like, you need to get out of the building. So, she, so she finally... Scene, basically. Yes. Okay. So, then she finally went out the back door, but then she realized she forgot something. Then she tried pushing us all the way. Now, at some point, she threw something. She threw the chair at her, yeah, but I was trying to stop her, though. Do you so, have any injuries on you? Do you have uh, there's somebody back there. Somebody back. Let me um give you this. Let me go get. I'm gonna get a PD. I'm gonna get a phone. I'm gonna take pictures of that. Okay. Um. All right. I didn't do anything. I'm Keep walking. Your hand the behind wall. your back now. You see? I'm, I'm walking from the job. Okay. Okay. Just okay. okay. And you see exactly for nothing. She slipped out. I'm walking from a job. Just fired. You see? Can you please call one, please? Are you the owner of Baltimore? Are they double locked right now? Yeah, they're double locked. The manager. I don't have anything. I'm a woman. A black woman. Which is why they're doing it. A black woman. Which is why they're doing it. I didn't touch them. They talk about touching them. I didn't do anything. I'm cuffed. You see my hand, don't you? <laughs> exactly. You know, bro. It's too thick at the bottom. You know, bro. I went through it. Come on, have a seat. You know, you see it. Have a seat. Try. Ma'am, you're going to the police station. And this Come on, is only work it worse. with me. All right, so wrong person. Yeah. Now you want to be me? She, we basically had to blockade the door. Okay. We were all blocking the door. She was trying to push her way through us. Back in like, like these east side back. doors. Yeah. Right this back door. Okay, so, so she uh, causes you try and fire her. She causes the scene. Says she's not leaving. Goes out the door. Is really just gets up and tries to come back in. Just kind of pushes her way through. Yeah, I said no. Okay. Yeah, and then she refused to leave. Yes. Okay. And then when did she throw the chair at you? Before she walked the door. Okay, so the first time? Yeah. How did she do it? Did she just pick a chair up? Well, she, she was throwing everything. Yeah, she, she was throwing stuff. She was throwing random stuff and throwing random stuff okay. all over. Yeah. The chairs, what yeah. else is she throwing? Do you want to go over here and show me what the chairs she threw? Y'all not listening. No, you're going to listen to me. You're not listening. You're going to listen to me. I didn't throw Either a chair. Either you're going to get in this car. Y'all going to watch the cameras. We're going to put you in. Right. So if we watch the cameras there's no chair, you're gone. Exactly. Okay. That's what I'm telling you. Why so don't you take yeah. my word? Okay. I'm not the one that called okay. y'all. They fired me off of the stupid. You've seen me on the job. Okay. Everybody f***ing spit if I spit out. I hope on your ass. If I wanted to spit out, hope on your ass. If I wanted to spit out, hope on you. If I wanted to. your feet in the vehicle. If I wanted to spit out, hope on her ass. If I wanted to spit. She'll go. She'll go. Trying to force you out. We just want you to come out. Either way, you're going to be here. Yeah, force me in. Force me out. I told you I didn't do anything. I'm walking to the mall. They fired me for no reason. Y'all y'all acting as if I'm a criminal like I had a gun in Dave and Buster's. That's how y'all treated me. I didn't do shit. Y'all see me walking. And y'all picked me up and threw me in a car like I'm a criminal. I didn't do shit. Did you do this red one? So she just grabbed it like tossed it at you? Okay. What's a, uh, what's a good photo for you, ma'am? Ain't no okay! It's not okay! That's the f*** y'all problem! It's not okay! What you talking about? Talking about okay? It's not okay! You gotta step out. We're not I'm not right. stepping out of s***. Pull me out like y'all put me in. Told you I didn't do anything. Pull me out. Drag me like y'all put me in this Like I'm a criminal. I didn't do anything. Y'all didn't see nothing on me. Y'all didn't find anything. Y'all got a call. Y'all goofy as Y'all got a call, and y'all did all of that. You should feel goofy as I'm not doing shit. Pull me out like y'all put me in. I'm not moving. I understand. Whatever happened out there... Nothing caused... happened. Hold on, hold on. That's what I'm talk, telling okay? you. Whatever caused this... They got a call, and they put cuffs on me as I'm walking by myself, unarmed, nothing on me, into the mall. Okay. Handled me like I'm a criminal. I didn't do... I don't have nothing on me. So I don't have. Okay, well let's. You're not listening. You oh, you, yeah, you, you 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 want to hurry up and finish me like no, I'm done talking. Car, so I wasn't breathe. done talking. You can breathe better out here. I can breathe right here. I'm talking to you, so that means I can breathe, right? Okay. Got you. What the? F what the? F I didn't do nothing. I'm unarmed. Didn't do anything. But they pushed me in here like I did something. I got fired. 
from the only job that I have, I have a right to be upset, being fired for nothing. You know, I feel like to the officers, the story does not add up because she keeps saying that she was fired for nothing and that she wasn't doing anything. But yet, as soon as she tells the officers, she ran into a store and started resisting immediately. So the story is just not really adding up. And based on her behavior, I feel like the establishment had a reason, you know, to let her go. And she must have threw a tantrum because she didn't like the fact that they were just letting her go on the spot. But that's just my opinion. But what do you guys think? But let's continue. They let my drink smoke weed, do coke in the parking lot, but I get fired? Workers do that? Yeah! Y'all should do your job and check them, not pushing me in a car. That's not up, man. I'm not getting out of shit. Y'all better pull me out like y'all pushed me in. We're gonna come out here. We do that all in here. It's nice and air-conditioned. I got hot pockets. I got coca cola I don't care water. about that. I want to go home. You know I gotta find another job. You don't... You got a job! You know how you go home? You don't understand it! We go in there and that's how we start to go home, okay? I'm not paying nothing. I didn't do nothing. I should not be here. You don't understand that. I didn't do anything. I'm not paying a bond. I'm not paying nothing. I don't have nothing. I don't have a job. Did I ever say you had to pay a bond? No, I've never been here. What are you talking about? I've never been in jail. Y'all not understand it. don't cost nothing. No, y'all asking as if I'm a criminal like I've been here, but I don't know this. I called you faith. I never called you criminal. They, you're not, you weren't there. Like I'm telling you, you weren't there. Come where I am. Come out in where I am. Okay? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Slow, you said follow me. I didn't say follow me. I said walk Yeah, I don't want my other wrist to be this red and bruised okay. up. Okay, okay. All right. How tight is it? Let me see. Tight enough that hurts. Tight enough for me to ask well, you to loosen it. So our policy right now is if we could fit a finger in there, it's. it's Man, I took it off before. Can you please okay. loosen it? No, I can't. Okay, Faith. So I'm gonna read you your rights right now. Okay. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can be used against you in court. You have the right to talk to her lawyer and have him or her present with you while you're being questioned. I just need a verbal yes or no. That's all. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to talk to me about? Kind of like what happened today or anything like that? I figured at this point, you know what happened or what they told you, so. Right. I mean, I so I know what happened, but I'm asking if you want to talk about it. You tell me what you thought happened. I don't know what I thought happened. I could see what happened on the videos. Tell me, please. What you saying? And then, then, then I, I, could, saw... I could vouch for myself. Okay. No, you tell me first. Go ahead. Because I, I really want to know what they told you and what you're saying. Okay. So from what I know and from what I saw on the cameras, you had a conversation in the back, like the back, I don't know, Dave and Buster's Private or something area. like that. Yeah. Okay. Um, I don't know what the conversation was over because there's no audio, but I was told that you were being terminated for I don't know what reason. Okay. Um, you got upset. You stormed out of there. You went like into the main area yeah, with the people. Yeah, grab my bag okay. in the front from the closet where I always keep my stuff. Yeah. Okay. And then you turned around and went back in there, right? Yeah. I went out the back door. Where I always go. Okay. That's where somewhere, I always go. Somewhere, and I, that's that's fine. Somewhere in that, uh, you you pushed like a chair. I don't think you really threw a chair, but you pushed a chair. It hit a uh, lady's knee. She got kind of cut up. And then uh, you hit, there was some kind of argument that took place like in the back by the garbage area outside. I was trying outside. to get my phone. They wouldn't yeah, let me get my phone. Yeah, it looked like someone went back and got your stuff yeah. for you, handed it to you through the door, and then... You walked over to Von Mauer. Yeah, or... I was trying to catch the bus home. Okay. I didn't have a car. Okay. That was the only job I had. And then when officers tried to talk to you, there was there was an yeah, altercation. Yeah, I, did, I didn't understand what the heck. There was okay. they didn't have no no right to stop me from walking into the mall Basically. because I supposedly, like you said, pushed a chair. I didn't throw a chair at anybody, but that's what they said that happened. But you seen for yourself that's not what happened, right? Um, okay, what did you see? Did you see me pick up a chair physically no, and throw it? I just told you I didn't see that. Okay, that's what I'm asking okay. you. So you said but there was what, another that's chair thrown. Con that's why I'm having a conversation with I'm, you. I'm trying to understand what you're saying, though. Okay. You said there was another chair thrown, but it wasn't by me. Like, when you, yeah, when you rounded the corner, there was a chair that got, like, pushed down to the ground. There wasn't a chair thrown by me. From she was sitting right there as I pushed the chair out the way and going out, going out the door, man. Come okay. on, I didn't... But you, but you pushing that chair and the chair hitting her, whether it was on purpose or not, that's that's why officers stopped to try to talk to you. No, I can't be charged with anything. Are y'all kidding me? You are. Okay, I'm, I'm telling you what you're being charged with, okay? Simple battery. I didn't 
do anything. I cannot be charged with anything. I didn't do anything. You see Did, the video. I, I saw. I saw you. Try I to cannot kick an officer be charged too. with I, nothing. I saw you kick an officer too when they had you up against the wall. I didn't kick anybody. Are you yes, kidding you did. me? You, yes, you, your leg came back and it. it I was the trying to sit shin. outside the car and kick. That was not when you were lying. It's okay. I know how y'all move. I'm gonna get out of it. You don't gotta say nothing else. Do what you need to do so I get the okay. That's it. That's fair, okay? Yep. Do you need any more water or anything nope. like that? I need to need you to do your job so I get the that's that's it that's fine by us okay all right that's about it for today so if you enjoyed any of those videos let me know down in the comment section which one is your favorite one also share with your friends and social media and yeah i think i'm gonna leave it at that and we out